All right, so I've got a 2000 uh, Ford Crown Vic with the 4.6 liter. Um, we were having a problem with the uh, intake manifold, the original manifold on this. Um, <clears throat> this part here was plastic and had a copper insert um, <laughs> that uh, that was causing the um, well basically that copper insert was molded into the plastic part and when we unscrewed this sensor um, the copper bung uh, twisted and caused a coolant leak so <clears throat> we've gone ahead and replaced the intake manifold as you can see the new style manifold comes with a metal crossover tube here uh, instead of the original plastic now <clears throat> because of that this coolant temperature sensor, or you know, the original one anyway, <coughs> uh, was grounding on the metal here. And uh, every time it would ground on the metal, we would get the temperature gauge spiking full hot all the time. You unplug that sensor, and it goes down to cold, obviously, because there's nothing there. Um, <coughs> so uh, after doing some diagnostics just troubleshooting this thing um, what we've come up with here is uh, we've obviously thread taped this which didn't change anything uh, because there's still contact with the metal once you screw it in so what we've done is we actually switched these two wires here on the sensor um, and used a uh, sensor for the newer model which this manifold should be a 2002 and up um, so I've gone ahead and updated it. Um, that was literally all we had to do was use a different sensor and swap these two wires around to reflect how the sensor works for the newer models. So um, <clears throat> um, just a, a quick fix, something to try if you're having the same issue, that temperature gauge spiking full hot all the time. Uh, but give it a shot.